Hi. Please.
Hercules, big ball, for the Rockets. Six ball. Six innings, 28 points, not that good.
You guys all still with us? Thirteen, cross side.
All offense. Nine in the corner. Actually, 14 in the side. Uh, nine in the corner. Straight pool player. Straight pool is a great game to get it struck to. Keeps you, it keeps you uh, eyes on combos, carrots, shape, planning. All right, so we sum up later. All right. Kidding me, kidding me. I gotta tell you, these pockets are tight. <laughs> well, I mean, they're four and a quarter, but still, uh, it's nine on the table.
six ball, three rails. Cross corner. Thanks for watching. Thank you for watching.
Look at this. Okay, I'm, uh, this is gonna be my last rack straight pool. I'm not even gonna dignify this with a, with a record or a score. Um, pretty bad. So after this one rack, I'm gonna play nine ball ghost. Do like race to race to nine. By the way, this table is playing perfect. I couldn't think of any other table or venue to have a, a big match. This, this table is probably the best table on the West Coast right now. Big ball in the corner.
All right, so uh, finally I'm like hitting it, hitting it all right, huh? That was like 30 innings for 100 points. That was ridiculous. All right, nine ball, race to nine. By the way, I want to thank Tony K at Tiger Products. This is where we're at right now, Tiger Products showroom. in Burbank, California. Need anything from Tiger, let me know. Is that, no, wait, you guys usually keep score, right? So like, uh, so like if I make three balls in one rack, that's one, three. And then if I make five more, then that makes it two, uh, eight. If I'm not mistaken, correct? So why don't I just do that? I'll just do the best score out of 10 racks, okay? So it'll say one and then the number of balls, two, will be the second rack and then the number of balls, all right? Let's do it that way. 10 racks, nine ball.
Got a short extension too, by the way. Goes right onto your queue. I actually played like uh, you know when the coronavirus just started the whole pandemic and lockdown. I didn't play for like two months, and then and then when I started again, I, I actually just started using this right away because I didn't have anything to compare it to anymore. It actually, feels good just to have it on your queue. You know, a lot of people playing with longer queues nowadays. Ah. 
Ai, ai, ai. Actually, the score is not right. I just ran two racks. That's nine times three, that's 27. Plus five from before. So I have 32 points.
cross side. Uh, so that's three because I made two on that one shot. Eight in the corner. I'll take it. I'll break this out.
crazy. Never give up. <laughs> Hey, I don't even I don't even know. Maybe some of you guys in the chat room you can like uh put up a couple of like results for nine ball, ten racks. I don't know, I don't know what's good. So I mean right now it's my eighth rack and I have 45 points. So if anybody knows what's good, I, I mean I, I really don't know what, what I'm reaching for. I'm having a whole lot of fun playing though. That's for sure. Jump cue. The Sev edition. Tiger Wings jump cue. All Sev wood. This is not carbon fiber. This is wood, guys. Matte finish. Beautiful jump cue. Uh, comes in three pieces. Okay, so I got a short jump right here. Let me tell you about jump cues. <laughs> Learn three cushion. You might as well be wearing diapers if you're gonna use a jump cue. <laughs> He's right, I could have kicked that ball in. Rack number nine now, I've got 49.
there. Lucky, lucky. All right, so actually, I'm doing the score wrong. It's it's really 958, but my 10th rack right now, and I have 58 points. So after this, I'm going to do 10 ball. I'm going to do a race to 10, 10 ball, or just 10 ball, 10 racks. Not race to 10, but 10 ball, 10 racks. Is there anybody right in the... No, nobody, but uh, Wambra's there, Derek De, La, De, De Losa, Farshid, hey, what's up? Wambra, Doug Preston, JNS, good to see you guys. Yeah, I don't know, I don't know what a good score is for nine ball, ten racks, but I'm happy, I'm having fun. On a nine foot diamond like this, see. I can't complain. Ten racks, sixty-seven points. That ain't bad, actually. I'm gonna screenshot that for nine ball. All right, we're gonna play ten ball now. Does anybody have anything to say? No. 
All right, 10 ball, 10 racks. So 10 racks, 67. Perfect score would be 90. Definitely room for improvement. But I'm happy because I, I did run like four racks. Now, here comes the really tough game, 10 ball. This two ball. I'm already in trouble. So, nine ball bank in this pocket, I guess. It's my only shot. Not even close. Two balls. Okay. You all hear me, It's going to be tough. Not yet. 
Hey, Vermin. Yeah, I, we might do that. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Bye. I love you. Bye. All right. I was thinking I might have to go back and forth, but I don't know. I just kind of like kept the faith there. Oh, no. Got Sharks by Geraldine. Three balls.
battery died. Battery died. Fourth track. Thank <laughs> you. 
Thank <laughs> you. 
No!
What's my player Q? My player Q. My player Q is a uh, Tiger TL3 with a Tiger three inch extension, four inch extension on it. I'm, I'm, I'm messing around with this. I, I don't usually use this, but this Q I use all the time. It's a Pro X shaft with an onyx tip. Fucking badass. Repetition. Is programming and programming takes away human emotion. Human emotion is what gets in the way of us making the balls. Hey, how are you? Good, how are you, man? Just, just hanging in there? Oh, shit. He's just hanging in there, folks.
Shorten that angle. It's an aluminum extension. It's light as a feather, man. But um, Tiger's thinking about modifying it a little bit. Can't really tell you how, but uh, it's, it's, it's beautiful, man. It's beautiful, beautiful. And you know what? The way, this is, uh, the way this screws on, it's like part of the base of the cue. It's, it's, uh, it doesn't go through the middle. It, 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 it's like a wider circumference thread. So what that means is the actual energy still uh, finds itself consistent throughout the queue. So the energy comes out, out through here and, and goes to the queue. It doesn't go to the center. So it's actually, it it's feels like it's part of the queue. It's kind of hard to explain, but I ain't no freaking scientist. Huh? Well, pool player. Pool for a living. I'm a hustler. <laughs> What's that? Huh? When you bump your extension on something, the cue plays different. Uh huh. Yeah, that's that's exactly. It does feel different. Yeah. Tell you a little story. I went to go clean this shaft, this particular shaft, right? No, actually, it was an older shaft. Anyway, I was going to play the Hard Times monthly tournament, and Al Romero was upstairs, always working on cues upstairs. So I go up there and I say, hey, you know, fix my tip a little, would you please? And then uh, clean the shaft, right? And Al Romero looks at me, he goes, looks at the shaft and says, oh no, 
I'm not going to clean this shaft, Daniel. I'm not going to clean this shaft. It's got, it's got energy in it, man. You, you can't release the energy that's in this shaft. <laughs> I said, what? Really? He goes, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you, I, 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 I'll, I'll use a little water, a little water, like, you know, get some of the dirt out, but I'm not, I'm not going to, I'm not cleaning this shaft. True story. I don't know if I won that day. I don't even remember, but <laughs> I like the story. play it cool, don't you? you guys saying what's my name my name is daniel daniel bush don't you forget it daniel bush like the beer and heiser so check this out right here's another story al romero right you know al romero is from new mexico and he was a hustler in new mexico back in the 50s and 60s like the guy finally broke out and he started playing in california and beating everybody but he used to go on the road. That, that was his thing. I, I like to go on the road. I go on the road, right? He, he's a little guy, little Al Romero. Makes cues. Good guy. Lives up in uh, Sacramento now. But anyways, he must be around 73, 74 now. So he, and he still plays every day. But anyway, he used to go into bars and he'd say, oh, man. How rude is YouTube? I tell you, that is rude, disconnecting me like that. So anyway, Al, Al used to go on the road, and we'd, he'd go on the road. He told me that when he'd go into a place, he'd say, uh, you know, let's play, let's play some. Let's play some nine ball. Let's play for money. And uh, people would say, well, I, I don't know. Uh, I don't know how – I don't know you. I don't know how good you are. And he would just say – I'm really good. You you can't beat me. I'm really, really good. You need weight. <laughs> That's what he would tell people. And he would beat people doing that. He would, they'd send the best guy in the, in the house to go play him, and, and he would beat him. <laughs> he would just be, he'd say, well, if he's your best guy, we're playing even. But anybody else in here, I'm too good.
Whoopsie. You can't beat me playing pole. You need weight. I'm too good. Whoopsie. That sucks. I suck. My room reminds me of the NFL HOF for some reason. The Hall of Fame. Oh, well, I'm in uh, Ron. Who's asking this? Seamus. Seamus McFadden. How the hell are you, Seamus? We're at the Tiger Showroom. Tiger Products Showroom. Tiger Cues, Tiger Products. This is where their showroom, this is their showroom. I did a live stream from here uh, about a week ago called the Tiger Rivals. You can check it out on my channel. Um, and we're gonna hopefully be doing more Tiger Rivals here soon. Today, I'm just playing the ghost at the Tiger Showroom. I'm in Burbank, California. Where are you, Seamus? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you now, boy? Hey, you know why, uh, you know why Ireland is the uh, biggest country in the world? Because it keeps Dublin and Dublin. Everybody needs a hustle. To find out more, go to tigerproducts.com.
in the game, four ball. Get in the game. Stun run, little unnecessary stun run. The banks are open. Sponsor all the way. guys from anyways seriously Seamus McFadden oh you love the ah Jimmy Mattia yeah you want that's it want me to show you how to hit that shot I don't remember I don't remember what shot <laughs> you're in Delaware holy crap you know, I've never been to, I've been to Vermont. That's about as far up there as I've been. Two rails in the corner. Four rails, four rails. I love banking balls. I love these diamonds. This table is playing so well. It's very, it's very hard to walk away from a table that's playing so good. Really, because it gives you true feedback, and uh, feedback's what you need when you're playing pool. You ever walk away from a shot? Go, what did I do wrong? What did I do wrong? Well, usually, if your cue and if your if the table, the if the balls are clean, all the equipment's good, you're getting good feedback, which means it's telling you what you're doing wrong. There are better ways to explain it, but the better your equipment, the better the feedback. You know, if you got a table that's rolling all crooked, you get bad feedback, so you don't know what you did wrong. You don't know if it's uh, you don't know if it's your stroke, the speed of the ball. You know, you can't tell anything. But it's really hard for me personally. To walk away from the table is playing this well. Because I'm getting such good feedback, it's really good practice, you know? This is tough. Tough, tough, tough. I think I want the short side right here. The ball floats past the 10 a little. I might have to jump it. I don't know, man. How do you do here? You just float down here. This is 
weird. This is a weird shot. I'm trying to get here. Look at this. I'll take it. I'll take what I can get. Speed, brother, speed. Practicing. Practice, yes. Yeah. You need a cue? I got nothing here. I got nothing. Side pocket. You tell me where the shot is, because it doesn't pass the nine. You guys, tell me where the shot is. I've got to make the ball. There's no safety. You just, you know, you're all off. Where's the shot, Adam? Where, 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 where I got to make this eight ball. There's no shot. Kick to the side. That's all I can think of. I, mean, I think it will play in that corner. Bank? Yeah. No. Dude, it'll come off the rail, but it's actually going to, it's not no, those far. No. no I think the kick to the side is the only shot where I can cut this. Or two rails in the corner. Yeah, kick to the side. Oh. <laughs> I need more practice, Coco. <laughs> yeah, so you can go right now. I'm doing a CBD. You know CBD? CBD? Yeah. yeah. CBD What's that? For your health. Oh, yeah. Uh, CBD yeah. muscle. I use it for my anxiety, my back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, thank you. Okay. Promote you? Yeah, promote something. We'll see if there's a good reason. Yeah, I'll check out the website and stuff. Yeah. Where, yeah. Are, where are you located? In Garden Grove. Garden Grove, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Are you, are you also are you just distributing or are you manufacturing? Uh, no, distributing. Okay. Yeah. yeah. It's my own formula. But yeah. I send out to the manufacturer. Okay. That's awesome. And, yeah. Okay. I have a tinctures, uh, muscle cream. Oh, that's great. Oh, that's great. Yeah, we need, maybe, maybe we'll work on your... It sounds possible. Yeah. It does sound possible. Yeah. yeah. So if you're interested in promoting to them, maybe. Yeah. We'll see. But I have to get some events going. That's the hard part, right? <laughs> Coronavirus. I know. No, nobody knows. It's a hard, the hard time, the hard to make an event happen. Man. I know. Shit. Yeah. 
And where you wear problems. Lots of problems, man, but you know, uh, just gotta take it a day at a time. And even a big company there is shutting down. Yeah, they're making big big changes, you know, all over the place. Yeah. You must be following the whole uh, cannabis culture then too, right? Yeah. You know, all the big companies, the, the investment companies and all that. You know? I know there's a company, NetNen. NetNen, you know them? Oh, okay. They have to scale down. A lot of them, definitely. Yeah, uh, scale down. A lot of them. Yeah. I, I supply my CBD to the gas station. Oh, yeah. Uh, small, small size. Yeah, yeah. Them, obviously. Mm -hmm. And uh, their sales went down 30 to 40. That means wow. probably no business. Yeah. You know Gilbert? Oh, yeah. He has two gas stations. Two gas stations? Yeah, he owns two gas stations. Oh, okay. What so, area? I think one is, um, one is in, like, uh, maybe Compton. Oh. Yeah, and I don't know where the other one, maybe in the valley somewhere. Oh. Yeah, that is okay. Compton is, uh... I don't know if it's Compton, then. I don't know. They had uh when what's his name? This guy, I think the rapper, he got killed. He died. Something hustler, whatever. Everybody was camping outside his gas station, so he had to close his gas station because the uh, rapper died and they were all hanging out there. All the fans and stuff. I don't know why. So also close to the hustler, is he maybe I don't know. I don't know where his gas station is. You know Gilbert, right? Yeah, I know him. Najee. Gilbert Najee? Yeah, yeah. Big yeah. Ocean player, yeah. 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 You know, I know him. Uh, yeah, you know. I, don't, I don't know him very well, but I, I saw him. Oh, okay. Yeah. Next time yeah. I see uh, you guys, I'll introduce you. All right. Yeah. yeah. Let me know if you can do anything about CBD. I will. Any I will. questions? Just, uh, yeah, I'll talk to I'll talk to my wife about it too. We've been thinking about promoting the the CBD and the cannabis, but um, but now it's just hard with no events. No. But um, let's let's uh, I'll talk to my wife about it. And we'll see what she has to say. She has very good ideas. Right now we gotta make money anyway. Yeah, so, no. because the uh, main business is not working. Look, I'm selling sanitizer and mask. Oh, really? Which is not part of my business. Yeah, but it is, <laughs> but it is now. Right? Yeah, I'm doing that too. Yeah. <laughs> That's good, brother. All right. Okay. years of practice get to my level yeah but I tell you man you know I got stories bro all the millions I made playing pool yep all the dark dark secluded basements in uh, the United States of America and beyond I could go on and on and on about it but I just let I just let my stick do the talking
You smell that? That's the smell of fear in the air, folks. Ain't nobody gonna come here and play me. I'm too good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'll be right back. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna quit. I'm, I'm quitting in like five minutes. Yeah, but I'm, I'm done. I'm like, this is my last round. Thank you. 